how is it going everybody mr android here well it's the end of 2023 and this year i have already featured a ton of amazing applications on this channel so i thought why not go ahead and show you the 10 best android apps of 2023 i'm sure you will end up installing couple of useful applications from this video and i will be giving away a bunch of promo codes so stay tuned and watch it till the very end also let's aim for at least 1000 likes on this one with that said drop a like leave a comment and let's get started Almost every Android smartphone comes with a punch hole that is located in the center of your phone screen and if you really want to make better use of this camera cutout, then there is an app called Touch the Notch which you need to install right now. What it basically does is, it converts that camera hole into a shortcut button. All you need to do is, simply install the app and then allow all the required permissions. Then you can start assigning different actions to this punch hole. If I tap on it, it opens my camera. Long pressing will take a screenshot and if it double tap, it toggles the flashlight. Not only this, it even allows you to add music controls and do lot more. Overall, I think it's a pretty useful application that is totally free on the Play Store. So be sure to check this one out. You will find all the links in the description below. Next up, we have the wallpaper app that has recently launched on the Play Store and it's called True AI. Even though I have tried plenty AI wallpaper apps throughout the year, I think this app has one of the best collection of AI generated wallpapers that are very unique, all high resolution and probably you are not gonna find such mind blowing wallpapers anywhere else. It also has a really modern, well designed UI. The For You tab provides you with free wallpapers that are gorgeous to look at and it's really difficult to find such high quality free wallpapers anywhere else. Other than this, there is a separate section that consists of different categories of wallpapers and if you really want to get access to these premium looking wallpapers to customize your home screen, then you need to have the pro version. Now fortunately, I do have 15 promo codes which will unlock all the categories for completely free. If you want to win one, all you have to do is subscribe to my YouTube channel, like and comment on this video and send me a DM on Instagram asking for the promo code. It's a first come first so basis. At number 3, we have one of the best launcher of 2023 and that is called Flow Productivity Launcher. It's a simple and a minimalistic launcher made for people who wants to reduce distraction and focus more on productivity. Once you set it as your default launcher, you get this simple and clean home screen which shows some of your favorite apps and you also get this date and time widget. On swiping right, you get a set of essential widgets such as the Google Calendar that shows all your events. Then we also have the to-do list but what I really liked is the screen time widget which shows the actual screen time and keeps you informed about how much time you have wasted so you can actually focus more on productivity. If you swipe up, you can access the app drawer that also comes with a search bar to quickly search your favorite app. And I also like how it automatically categorizes all your favorite apps in different categories for easier access. Apart from this, we also get the focus mode which lets you access only the home screen apps for a certain period of time so you can focus more on productivity. Now if you go inside launcher settings, there are a bunch of customization options like you can change the icon pack, set up different wallpapers, apply widgets to your home screen and do lot more. Now even though this launcher is totally free to install, if you really want to unlock some exclusive features then you need to have the pro version. So definitely give this app a try. It's one of the best launcher you can find on the Play Store. Did you know Pixel phones come with a very useful search feature that lets you easily find anything on your phone. You can quickly search through your apps, contacts, web suggestions and even files without having to open multiple applications. Now if you really want to get this useful feature on any Android phone, then there is an app called Pixel Search which has recently launched and it is totally free on the Play Store. Once installed, simply open and allow all the required permissions. Here you can customize and select all the apps that you want to search. Whether you want to search through all your contacts, files, it even lets you to manage your web suggestions as well. Once you are done setting up the app, simply long press and select widgets. Here you will find a brand new pixel search widget. Just drag it onto your home screen, that's it. Now whether you are looking for a specific app, a contacts phone number or a file you recently downloaded. This search bar can help you find anything in just a few clicks. With Android 14, Google added some beautiful widgets and even if you don't have a Pixel smartphone, you can install this amazing widget pack called Adaptive 14 KWGT. This pack comes with more than 100 Android 14 adaptive style widgets and all these changes the color automatically depending on the wallpaper that you have applied on your home screen. As you can see, these widgets are heavily inspired by the material you design language. And if you really want to get that pixel look on your home screen, then I think it's a must have widget pack for you. 
Now, unfortunately, this is not a free widget pack. It is paid, but I do have 30 promo codes to give away. To get one, all you have to do is like and comment on this video and send me a DM on Instagram asking for the promo code. It's a first come first serve basis. Next up, we have an app called Folder in Folder. With this, you can now organize all your apps into subfolder and add them to your home screen. Basically, you can put all your folders in one place and access them anytime you want with just a single tap. This way, you can definitely keep your home screen clean and less cluttered. All you have to do is just open the app and start adding all your folders and apps in this one big folder. If you want, you can also edit the app label and customize the icon as per your preference. Once that is done, simply click on this option that says add to your home screen. I think this is the best way to organize your home screen. And if you're a person who likes creating a lot of different folders, then it's a must have application for you. The next app on this list is called Musia. This is an app that allows you to control your music while your screen is off. Whenever you have music playing and you lock your phone, the app still shows the album art for the music info and you can change the track. You can pause it and you can also see the battery percentage at the bottom. Not only this, it also comes with a lot of customizations. You can change the font style, increase or decrease the size and you can even add different colors as well. Guys, if your phone has an AMOLED screen, and you really want to take full advantage of that always on display, then I will highly recommend you to install this amazing app on your phone. It works like an always on music for your Android smartphone. Next up, we have an app called Standby Mode. So if you have seen the latest version of iOS, we get this amazing new standby feature that basically give users a full screen experience with glanceable information designed to be viewed in landscape mode. And this feature comes really handy when you are charging your phone. To get this unique feature on your Android smartphone, you simply need to install this app and allow all the required permissions. You get bunch of beautiful looking clock faces that gets activated when you are using your phone in landscape. Overall, I think it's a great app by using which you can easily get the iOS standby feature on your Android smartphone. Definitely give this app a try. This next app is absolute must have for all the Android users and it's called Quick Settings. What it does is, it allows you to add more useful toggles in your Quick Settings for easier access. You just need to open up the app and start assigning different toggles for different actions. You can add a separate toggle for taking screenshots. To open apps in split screen, you can add a toggle for internet speed or to open your favorite applications. You can open the calculator directly from your quick panel and do lot more. Trust me, once you install this app, you'll end up adding more useful tiles in your quick settings panel and it can definitely save a lot of your time as well. Finally, we have an app called Tab Scroll. You know iOS has this really cool feature where if you want to go to the top of any website, you just need to tap on the status bar. No matter which app you are in, it lets you automatically scroll back to the top. This app brings the same functionality to your Android device. All you have to do is just install the app and allow the permissions that are required. Now go to settings, select scroll to tap action for single tap. Apart from this, you can also toggle the flashlight when you double tap on the status bar like this. Once you are done setting up the app, now let's say you are browsing your Twitter or X feed and you want to go right to the top. You just need to tap on the status bar. Again, this can save you some time and I think it's a great feature to have on your Android devices. So that's pretty much it for this video. Let me know in the comment section which is your favorite app from this list. And if you guys like this video, then be sure to hit that like button. Subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. I'm Mr. Android and I'll see you guys in the next one.